Hi, I'm Anya. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I would like to share with you a recipe for Polendvica z cebulą. It's a beef steak with onion and it's a simple really way to prepare uh, this kind of meat. And it just um, got to my head after I smelled something on the street. I was walking back with Sebastian from school and I smelled someone cooking something and I just remember my mom, like at least 20 years ago, preparing this meat. And I had to call her and ask her for a recipe. It's really, really simple, but it is delicious. And I hope you guys are going to give it a try. And in case you decide to do that, let's have a look at the ingredients so you know what you need. I'm starting with chopping my onion. And I have a little bit of a help here, but the knife is not sharp enough, I'm afraid. <laughs> assistant assistant <laughs> when we have all the onion chopped I have a couple of tablespoons of oil and I'm going to heat it up on my pan add the onion sprinkle it with a little bit of salt and then I'm going also sprinkle it with a teaspoon of sugar that will help the onion caramelize better and now we're going to be cooking it for um, five minutes, I would say, around until the onion is nice, golden and soft. Just like this, we keep the heat at uh, medium high. Onion ready, I'm transferring it to a saucepan and taking care of my meat. So I have it already cut, I'm sprinkling with some salt and then I'm drenching it in flour and that will help to thicken our sauce later on. Okay, all the meat needs the salt and flour and when it's ready again around a tablespoon of uh, oil I'm putting on my pan heating it up and then frying my meat I would say a minute on each side I don't want to overcook it okay, then on the other hand we don't like our meat raw but uh, if you overcook it it tends to get hard Okay, both sides ready and we're transferring it to our saucepan with onion. Okay, on the heat, uh, we put a medium low, add water, give it a good stir so it mixes with the onion and it's covered. And then we're cooking it for around 15 minutes. Now it's also going to depend on your meat, so just check when your meat is tender, is ready. And this one was amazing, juicy and soft. And my dinner is ready. I hope you guys are going to give it a try too. I hope you enjoy the movie. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.